father of California winemaking has died. Robert Mondavi, who insisted that Napa Valley wines can compete with the best in the world, has passed away at the age of 94. Michael Brownlee and the street team look back at his life. His name is synonymous with great wines. Robert Mondavi was a pioneering vintner who opened his Northern California winery in 1966 with his brother Peter. They never lost sight of their initial goal in spite of their decades-long feud to put California, specifically Napa Valley, on the wine-producing map. Bringing the best of Europe to America back when really nobody was doing it. He was the first. His top-notch namesake reserves and his partnership with Mouton Rothschild to produce Opus One, that's him on the left of the label, are favorites at the Wine House in West L.A. Those of us in the wine industry uh, have great respect for the uh, capabilities of the Mandavi family in producing great wines. The wine cellar at downtown Pacific Dining Car Restaurant keeps a hefty stock on hand. Its wine director should. Mondavi was known to pop in for dinner unannounced. Mondavi really is the number one thing that comes to mind when you think, what's a, a wine that anyone you know, can name off the top of their head? He really created a legacy that everyone can relate to on some level. The flag at Mondavi's winery flies at half staff. The grounds were open, but employees are getting the weekend off to honor the winemaker who believed making good wine is a skill, fine wine, and art. We've lost a, a great ambassador of wine. Now, Robert Mondavi received a number of domestic and international awards for his palate-pleasing wines. One of the most prestigious came back in 2005 when he received the Legion of Honor Award, which happens to be France's highest presidential honor. Robert Mondavi leaves by, behind his wife, three grown children, nine grandchildren, and his brother, Peter. Reporting live near downtown Los Angeles tonight, I'm Michael Brownlee. My 13 News.